Welcome guys, welcome to another edition of More Some More Moment. Today we're going to be discussing the double-breasted jacket or even the double-breasted suit. So we had a question come in and he said guys look I'd really love to see a video on the double-breasted suit in particular can you touch on topics such as do I have to worry about wearing it in terms of wear and are there any special occasions where they need to be worn? So um, here we are. Yeah, here we are. All right, so for you guys who haven't realized I'm wearing my double-breasted suit today. I know somebody commented in a video, oh, you guys never really wear double-breasted suits. If you look back, we have a number of times. Yeah, so anyway, we're quite a few. Yeah, this is my one I'm wearing today, mm -hmm. especially for this video. Double-breasted suits, it's, a, it's an interesting one. Double-breasted suits are a little hard because you, they're not something that are common in most offices. They're not something that are common on off the peg as well um, because not many people like to wear them all the time. The difficulty with double breasted is when you're wearing it, generally it should always be done up, obviously other than you're, if you're sitting down. Um, so some people like the freedom of having their jacket open. So like to walk around and feel a bit freer. So for that reason, double breasted is is not something that many people wear unless you're you're somebody who's got a number of suits. So for example, if you have three suits in your wardrobe, it's unlikely you have a double breasted suit. If you have maybe six, seven suits in, likely one of those I would say go for a double breasted suit because then you know it adds variety. And I'd say it's more for the would you say maybe the more style conscious guy who wears a, a double-breasted suit and maybe the older generation as well. The difference with the older generation however is a lot of their double-breasted suits are quite boxy and, and straight fitting so you get a lot of the guys with the bigger bellies. Uh, that's why some people don't have a favourable thoughts when it comes to double-breasted suits. However these days as you can see by the cut of my suit and the suits that we do for our clients they are a lot more slicker, a lot more fitted and uh, you know they fit to the body form very well. So this is what is um, some of the thing that's really influencing the re-emergence of the double-breasted suit. So you'll see a lot more guys wearing it these days. Uh, the problem is, again, if you get it off the peg, you will find it hard to get a great fit. So these are the things to worry about when it comes to buying a double-breasted suit. Like all suits, Getting them tailor-made is always gonna be the best option, but the double-breasted suit even more so because you want it to really just nip in at the size and fit your body form well, um, so it doesn't become unflattering. Anything else to worry about? Oh, okay, so to wear it, a lot of people wear double-breasted suits um, to the office. Um, that would probably be one of the main places to wear it, but again, it all depends on your culture. Like we said on other suits when it comes to, you know, plaids and things of that nature, it really depends on the culture of your office. Um, you know, if it's, I don't know what office it would be an, an issue in, but if you're somebody who wears a lot of suits, I think a double breasted suit is fine in most offices. Um, it's just getting that right cut. You know, there are a number of guys as well who I've seen wearing double breasted suits with jeans. And again, if you have the right cut with the right colors matching your jeans, it can be a, it can be a great look as well. Or again, with some nice chinos. Yeah. Nice chinos, some loafers, you know, sockless. Amazing look that you can go for. That's it. If you're, if you're somebody who, who likes a double-breasted suit, go out and buy one, add it to your collection. And again, yeah, it's a personal choice. I love them. We love them. Our, a number of our clients love them. Um, yeah. That's it. There you have it. So look, I hope you learned something today from today's video of double-breasted jackets. Take the best parts, throw away the rest, and as always, continue to like, comment, and subscribe on our videos. We appreciate every single one. Continue to send your questions in to us at ask at mortomore.com and also continue to follow us on our several, oh, and interact with us on our several social media streams from Facebook, LinkedIn, Instagram, Twitter, YouTube. And interact with us in person too. That's it. Yeah, all right. So until next time, guys. Yeah, you can't you can't have a shoe conversation without saying Mr. Hair. Like, yeah, that is like Mr. Hair. Look, or favorable, favorable, favorable.